hello friends in this tutorial firstly i will tell you what is binary options trading and then i will show you by making a trade on binary options so as you can see this is a currency pair a financial instrument on binary options trading and this is a purchase time so firstly we need to select a purchase time that can be that can that starts from 1 minute and if we select a 1 minute expiration time then we will have 30 second purchase time and 30 second expiration time secondly the price of this asset is at this point now when i click on higher then after expiration time is over the price of this asset should be a little bit above from this to make me profit if i clicked on higher and price of this asset remains down a little bit down from this point then i will make loss of my full investment similarly if i click on lower at this point then if the price of this asset remain a little bit below from this then i will make profit or if the price of this asset remain a little bit above from this then I will make a loss <clears throat> now I want to show you how actually binary options trading is happening in real world so for this I have selected a binary options trading platform called IQ option if you don't have an account on IQ option you can sign up from the description that I have given below this video so this with this platform you can learn you can also click on this section video tutorials and learn many thing about binary options similarly you can also take part in tournaments where you can win decent amount of prize real fund by increasing the given fund on tournament account so it would cost you a little bit dollar in this case you will have to <coughs> you can join the tournament by paying up to dollar four but as a new trader uh, you have chances to get entry to some free tournaments where you can win real fund now i would like to show you by making a trade as i as i have said before this is a this is a financial instrument in binary options trading a currency pair now firstly we need to select expiration time that is that is starts from one minute you can select any minute here so i am selecting one minute now we have purchase time of 33 seconds and we will have expiration time of 30 seconds now i can click on higher and if the price of this asset goes above from this when the expiration time is over then I will make profit and if I click on higher and the price of this asset remain below from that point then I will make a loss so let me click higher here so I invested amount of one dollar now if the price of this asset remain above from this green line then I will make profit if it remain above below from this then I will make loss now we have expiration time of 23 seconds now let's see what happens in this trade as you can see price is below so our expected profit is showing our minus one dollar now three second remaining two second one second zero second so see the price of this asset remain below from this point where I clicked on higher that's why I made a loss of one dollar now let us click on lower from this point now I have clicked lower so now the price of this asset should remain below from this red line to make me profit if this price of this asset remain above from this line within this expiration time then I will make loss in this trade too now let's see what happens <coughs> as 
as you can see, there is 11 second expiration time remaining. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. So, as you can see, I have made loss in this trade. Now, let me invest $10 on high area again. Now, the price of this asset should remain above from this line to make me profit. Now, our purchase time is 9 seconds and additional 30 second expiration time will uh, remain because we have selected 1 minute of expiration time. Now, let's see what happens in this trade. As you can see, there is 11 seconds remaining for expiration time to be over. So, the price of this asset remained above from this point where we made a trade. So, I made a profit of $7. Similarly, now let's invest a $10 in lower now if the price of this asset remain below from this line then we will make profit and again if the, if the price of this asset remain above from this line then we will make loss now 27 second time expiration time is remaining now let's see what happens in this trade As you can see, the price of this asset remained below from this red line. That's why I made a profit of $7. This is the actual way of trading binary options. And I hope I was able to make you understand what actually is binary options trading. So if you don't have an account on binary of IP option, then you can sign up from a link below. You can get a practice account of $10,000 where you can practice uh, trading similar kind of trading that I just show you now and thank you for watching this video bye bye